Welcome back to Ballhead and Metal, guys, and welcome back to another reaction. This particular reaction is coming by way of a Patreon request with a band Vita Imana with their song, I'm going to say Chaos. Um, I don't know what to expect here, but the person who recommended this, Fred, usually recommends me pretty good stuff, so I kind of trust this taste for the most part. We sometimes disagree, some, most of the time we kind of agree on our opinions. Uh, but those who are fans of this band, just know I do express myself 100%. If I don't like something, I say it. I try to do it respectfully so we can talk about the music in interesting ways and have interesting conversations. Uh, but it's never kind of ill-intended towards the band. It's more of personally how I feel. That being said, let's get into it and see what we got. And if you enjoy this style of reactions, make sure to subscribe down below for more. Are they Brazilian uh, with a drumming like that? First of all, that lady caught me off guard. I was not expecting her. She looked like their mom in the, in the beauty video, and that's no disrespect to the woman. It's just like, I it just wasn't expecting it. It's like just a regular woman just kind of hanging out, and the next thing you know, she's beating on the drums and going full force, man. Rock on, lady. Like, I love it. Um, I'm enjoying this kind of uh, hardcore hate breed vibe that they're having. I do find the, the headbands a little bit silly. I always have, uh, especially in a bull head. Uh, I don't think headbands look good on me. Uh, but that being, you know, me being goofy aside, so far I'm kind of enjoying the heaviness of the song and kind of the aggression of the song. Don't know if I'm in love with it yet. Don't know if I hate it yet. I'm definitely intrigued. I'll be honest with you, my brain is fighting. There's, there's a part of me that really like that breakdown right here in the end was fucking badass. And the other part of it is really kind of first the word that comes to mind, and again, it's not to be mean, is goofy. So there's like these two things that are coming into my brain. I'm like, this is freaking goofy. But man, this part is really badass. Man, I really love their energy and they're really aggressive and really like going for it. But I think they might be overdoing it. It's like, it's like a, this battle in my brain of how I feel about this song. To be honest, I can't really like, put a finger on it, like wh how I feel about it so far. Oh, 
I do remember now. I remember him mentioning that this is a band from Spain. I like the one hundred percent like the idea of a section percussion, second percussion instrument, introducing these more tribal drum beats, but you barely hear it in the song. So I think the idea is great, uh, but it's kind of drowned out by the heaviness of the song. The positives are for me: it's super aggressive, it's super energetic, it it goes places, it progresses and does things, but it might be. Like they're so hardcore and so hard to trying to be hardcore that it becomes goofy, you know. Like the imagery is not helping me. Let's put it this way: like if I listen to the song, I think I actually would have enjoyed it a little bit more than with the music video because with the music video, it's just like, dude, Jesus Christ! Like I get it. You want to be heavy and loud. I understand. Um, and this, that middle part was really badass. So I would say, generally speaking, I come away with a more positive feeling, and actually, I would want to check out more from them. Um, but I'm also not in love yet. It's kind of somewhere in the middle. Um, yeah, let me know what you thought of it, guys. Like, how do you feel about it? I would love to hear her percussion instruments to be more prevalent when before the drum stops and she kicks in, so you can hear her 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 drumming patterns more. Because I think the the, the Latin spanish or african uh style middle eastern style drumming that's very different from the traditional uh drumming we hear in like a rock and classic rock is really interesting like what sepultura did with roots bloody roots i thought was great like it really sounded different that's why like even uh soulfly it has just a different style of drumming because it's always been the dna of the band and here i think it fits very well as well it's just the production wise i don't think it's very balanced um but let me see again what you guys think of it and make sure to enjoy the rest of your day stay safe out there guys and most of all keep it metal